The sound effects are so funny. Okay, sorry. Technology and society. And how was I, I mean, obviously, there's a, a lot of benefits of going there. Uh, I got to meet some really good friends, got to play basketball, and then at the same time, uh, pursue an education that I could be proud of. How is it? Is it hard to be a student at Yeah, obviously, it's going to be challenging for anybody uh, starting uh, school at Stanford. Uh, and then just with the time management and the academic requirements. Adjustment to make coming from uh, any high school. What's the hardest part about being a student athlete in Stanford? Uh, you're required to do everything that a, a regular student has to go through. You have the same homework, the same hours requirement, but then you also add in your uh, practices, your weights, your meetings, and uh, all those other things. Plus, uh, you get tired from sports, so you have to battle all those extra things and uh, still uh, do well. Obviously, the Europe Arena is really nice. Uh, I thought there was always 
great support from the fans and now being here uh, feeling that support it's, it's very obvious that uh, it's a good environment. I mean, obviously, Nick's been a legend in uh, in Japan for a very long time. Uh, he also played uh, college ball at Reno, which is really close to Las Vegas, where I where I was playing my high school basketball. So I obviously knew of Nick even when he was in college. Um, so getting to play with him uh, and, and what turned out, what's turning out to be his last year is, uh, I think, a pretty uh, exciting. でちょっと自分の近くの上。先生、あいやいやいや。あいいじゃない。でちょっとポーズブリ。あいやいやいや。I came to Kawasaki and you met no me again. Yeah, I mean, obviously he, he had a few more years of experience. Uh, when we first uh, played together, he was uh, he was a young. I, I mean, he's still young, but he was an inexperienced player. But now he's uh, he's uh, played under Yuma, played under Gino for these last uh, few years, and I can tell that uh, being under their leadership, he's really grown a lot. Ah, What's your favorite spot in Kawasaki so far? Um, like to eat or to hang out or, I mean, uh, obviously Kawasaki Station has a lot going on, uh, uh, Musashi Kosugi, is that still considered Kawasaki? Yeah, yeah. uh, that's where my, my daughter goes to her, uh, exercise classes, so we go there quite a bit, uh, but yeah, it's, it's a lot of, uh, really cool places that are only a few, uh, few stops away by train. What's your favorite Japanese food? Sushi. Maguro. Sushi. Maguro. Maguro. Toro. Chutoro. Potoro. What's the difference between Hungarian food and Japanese food? Uh, <laughs> Hungary is a landlocked uh, country, so we don't get uh, as much access to uh, ocean uh, fish, creatures, shrimp, anything like that. So it's, uh, it's very much so a different diet as far as uh, the type of meats and, uh, and produce we, we have available. What's your favorite Hungarian dish? Uh, paprika. Yeah. paprika. Just like that. side of me I guess than what they're used to see on the court. I hope you guys uh, purchase it and enjoy it. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye.